Fifth grade is when I first started to play classical music. I started out on the violin and I quickly realized that the violin was not for me. So the band director approached me and said, you know, we have a lack of bassoon players. Would you be very interested in, you know, playing the bassoon? I was like, I guess, sure, I'll try it. So from the, at that point forward, I was playing the bassoon and, you know, I fell in love with it, decided that it was what I wanted to do with my life. I found NYO, I believe, through social media and YouTube. I was young when it first came to be back in 2013. I believe I was at Interlochen, and I remember just everybody talking about the youth orchestra with the red pants. And I was like, whoa, that sounds super cool. And I fell in love with just the level of music and like the level of talent that was in that orchestra. So I eventually decided to audition for NYO myself in 2015 for the first time. That tour was to China. My first flight will actually be to China this summer with the National Youth Orchestra. I've never flown in an airplane before. The interpersonal relationships during NYO, I think, are really what makes the experience very vivid and very meaningful and impactful. The vibe of NYO is very loving, caring, passionate, very welcoming. I think NYO opened up my world musically by just exposing me to the highest level of classical music for my age range. We're playing, you know, professional level repertoire with world-class conductors and soloists. People that are now in the New York Philharmonic, playing in different orchestras around the entire world. I am currently the principal bassoonist of the Fort Worth Symphony Orchestra. To win the principal bassoon job here in the Fort Worth Symphony at such a young age, I think was very surreal for me at the moment. To finally have done that, I think was just something that I owed to all of the things that have come before, all of the people that have helped me get to where I am today, all of the programs that really shaped me into the musician that I am today. The other night I was just scrolling through uh, my Snapchat memories and I remember just posting a Snapchat five years ago in a random practice room at Juilliard. And I was just thinking, I was like, I don't think five years ago when I was sitting in this practice room that I thought five years later I would be in an orchestra in a city loving what I do and really sharing art with the world. I feel like NYO really helped open my eyes to what classical music can sound like and what I, as an individual musician, was capable of.